Well, that turns out to be the problem. When I first started, I wasn't a grower. I didn't grow anything. I was a nuclear engineer and other things like that in life, you know? And so when I first started growing cannabis, I, I kind of went back to basic biology, and that was what really powered cellular reproduction of a plant and what, what caused the hormonal production and all these things that it needed to, to optimize the growth of that plant. And when you get back in the end, there's a couple fundamental things, and I, that's what it, I said well ago. One is sugar production within the plant. Mm. Well, that turns out to be the problem. The reason is because that's where your sugar is produced. Right. And so therefore, by defoliating, what, there's two things you're doing. You're taking away the solar panels and the sugar production and you're stressing the plant. So one of our studies showed that if you remove 15 percent of the leaves off of the cannabis plant, you stunt the growth of that plant by uh, two days on average. If you do a defoliation, at, say, day 21 and you do 30 percent defoliation, you just lost a week of growth. You've lost two weeks out of eight to nine weeks which you'll never recover. So when you're in a perpetual cycle, that, that's a big deal. You compound that over time. Exactly. Now, when you affect plant growth and plant height, rather than defoliating or topping, you're actually playing around with light spectrum to kind of uh, keep them short and squat. Exactly.